a husband and a wife even yesterday you didn't sleep well but I was supposed to be calling you there's a serious fight even now it's like you want to divorce come forward come forward now don't divorce come forward don't divorce they are here they are here and always uh, my brother feel like he's not respected but and which is very, very true. Come forward. Where is the brother? Where is he? There were, even yesterday, you didn't sleep. Yesterday. Come. Where is, the, where is the husband? Because the person I'm calling, the husband is here, the wife is here. Where is, where is your husband? It's not here. He's not here. You are not the one. The person I'm calling, the husband is here. You know, yours is different. Let's come. come. This is the one. Where is the okay. husband? Huh? He's outside. Please call him. Call him. This lady, she's tired. Always she's told she doesn't respect. Is it not true? It's true. It's true. Huh? It's the, you do everything, but they say you don't respect. <laughs> yes, yes, Pastor. Go and call your husband. <laughs> My mom is here. She can your mom is here. Yes, my in-law. No, let us not call your mom. <laughs> He's outside. Where is Where is Mama? You see now, if we put parents now, it's no longer good. Winter. 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 Why are you doing this on winter time? <laughs> Why are you doing this on winter time? Where, where, where is your mom? Mama, okay. Your in-law. Yes. Call them out. Eh? The in-laws. Uh, this is a serious case, I'm telling you. This is the in-law. Mama, you're the in-law. Huh? She's a yes. Where is the brother? Okay, He's coming. Let him come. He's sitting outside. He's coming. It's him there that is coming. We are calling. Can you see? I another one came. I said, "It's not the one. Jesus. This is a serious case." Jesus. Is serious. Brother, come. What you wait, Look at how the brother is working, but he can't even walk properly. Yes. Yesterday, you people don't sleep. Yes, yes, it's true. It's true. Look, somebody can walk properly, but they say, "Your wife, you are useless." Mama, Jesus. You, were you aware of their problem? Yes, yes, eh? yes, yes, Pastor. I do talk to women, I think, long time. So they Can you see, you people here, you are putting our parents in Le, bed. Jesus. When you say my in-law was here, I didn't even want her to come. Because look at the Lord. brother, how he's sick, walking this way. And here he's playing with his wife. Now, what is it that mama will say now? Are, are you getting my story now? Eh? You don't hurt your parents. You, and also you must never, listen, you must never call your parents. And tell them bad things. After you fight yesterday, disagreement, hello mama, my husband, we're fighting. You are killing your parents. Can you solve your problem together? Can you see my brother? Can you go there where your husband is? Brother, you can stand there. And why were you outside, my brother? Why a little chicken devotee? Why were you sitting outside? Why a little chicken? I was tired. My legs were painful. You say you was tired, and I agree with him. Our church takes a long time. The whole day. It doesn't. It doesn't want people to get tired. 
Because our churches, you know, we believe in God. The Bible says, those who trust their God, their strength shall be renewed. They will never get tired. <clears throat> you are becoming tired because of how you are living in the house. Yes. You know, if now you understand that God gave you a right wife, God can even heal you. Yes. But can you see, look at your mom here. My brother, you can look at your mama. Your mama, she's mama. not happy with you. Isn't it not true, mama? Yes. Huh? Can you see your mom is crying now? Mama is so happy with you. Mama, Here God gave you a wife who oh, trusts you. Here you are sick. And this lady, she's tried to be close to you, try everything. If this lady can go, who can marry you? My brother. You and me, we are ugly. You and me. If you are ugly like me, you must take your advantage. You stay with your wife. Huh? Are you hearing my brother? Yes. Look, yes. Mama, she's crying. Look here. Here you are killing yourself. You are destroying yourself. When God gives you a wife, you must check. Proposing a wife to agree and say, I will marry you. It's an honor. It's an honor. The Bible says, He will find a wife, find a favor from the Lord, and He find a good thing. Brother, there is nobody here in this church here. If you take this lady away, that will love you because you are, you are ugly like me. This this lady, you must respect her, is your wife. You must stand with your wife. Don't destroy mama. You are destroying mama. Okay. Mama. mama, she's afraid now, if I can tell you. One thing that mama she's afraid of is this girl, if she can go, what yeah, will happen? Is it not true, mama? <laughs> it's, true. Huh? it's true. Because always she say, I don't want this girl to go. <laughs> I don't want... huh? yes. It's not true. I'm praying for that. I don't know how this thing You don't want her to go. No. Brother, do you love your wife? Yes, of course. Uh, yes, of course. So, of course. God loves you, of course. That's why you were outside and That's God why located you. It's for your marriage to stand from today. Thank you. Thank you. Thanks, thank God. Hug your wife, brother. Hug your wife. Hug your wife. You will never fight again. In the name of Jesus. You will never fight again. Amen. In the face of my brother. And brother, as you are doing that, God is healing you. Congratulations, Mama. They will never fight. Hallelujah. God bless you.